Hi, if you're like me, you know The Dukes of Hazard 1979 is one of the best TV series of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun if you put up a chair by the campfire and watch it again with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023. Okay, let's see together. Luke Duke is played back to Tom Wobat. In 1979 when filming, he was 28 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 71. Oh, and shoot his tires out, but I'm afraid you'd miss and hit arms. I sure wish there were some girls around here. Maybe you'd show off and drive faster. What's cool about him is that I, I actually directed half a dozen episodes, and and it's, it's such a beautiful car to, to shoot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, from any... Scooter is played back to Ben Jones. In 1979 when filming, he was 38 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 81. South wire. That means you're right on top of us. You better check it out. Scooter, you stay here. It, kind of, it was never in this good of a shape. Uh, came out of an old junkyard down there in Rockdale County, Georgia, and I drove the heck out of that thing. Daisy Duke is playback actress Catherine Buck. In 1979 when filming, she was 25 years old, and now she's living out the life at the age of 69. Where they are, I'll be on my way. Your guess is as good as mine. But seeing that I'm the only Duke here right now, why don't you tell me what's bothering you? So, yeah, it's devastating. And so people, when people need help, I mean, I've been, I've had my struggles and when I really had to count on my friends. Bo Duck is played back to John Schneider. In 1979, when filming, he was 19 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 62. We're gonna have to help her out. She'd never take a hand out. Maybe we could uh, kind of slip the money into her suit. Actually, this. Um, as you can imagine, Stephanopoulos said, he is devastated. Enos is played by actor Sonny Schroyer. He was 44 years old when filming in 1979, and now he's living out the life at the age of 87. Well, who's his own partner? Boss Hall, guess who? You reckon Jesse knows that? Enos, of course he knows it. Whenever I double- It right. is, it yeah. is. What, what, what kind of background is Schroyer, is that? You know, I don't know, I'm afraid to look. <laughs> yeah, really. That's okay, I'm afraid to find out- <laughs> Coy Duke is played back to Brian Cherry. He was 27 years old when filming in 1982, and now he's living out the life at the age of 67. It's bliss for me. Yeah, what are you trying to do, give my little fat buddy here a vapor lock? Yeah. Well, you cheated those kids. Well, they sure looked old enough to know what they wanted. But you told them it was good for Now, uh, Alicia Snyder, and uh, they just recently got married. Um, anyway, they, she asked me if I would like to be in their movie, and I'm, I'm like, what movie? And I said, Sheriff Roscoe Coltrane is played back to James Best. He was 53 years old when filming in 1979, and sadly on April 6, 2015, he passed away at the age of 88 in Hickory, North Carolina, USA. The ask you is, who he is? He? Yeah. Who's he? When I, you said that he was going to break the treaty with his government. American? And she said yes. I kissed her right in the mouth. <laughs> And she said, you crazy, mm -hmm. uh, I'll call the police. I said, I am the police, what can I do? Bro Tolliver is played back to Mel Tillis. In 1979 when filming, he was 47 years old, and sadly on November 19, 2017, he passed away at the age of 85 in Ocala, Florida, USA. And breeding some of the scrubbiest stock in Hazard County. <laughs> well, no, no question about that. Jesse, but uh... talked too well in those days. I still can't. <laughs> but I was a singer in those days. I'd uh, I'd get up and entertain, and I'd get up at, at the Boy Scout. Cletus is played back to Rick Hurst. In 1979, when filming, he was 33 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 77. All people put out that fire. But it wasn't my fault, cause boss, they would just be neighborly. Neighborly. You call beating a man out of one million dollars? Neighborly? Well, nobody's beating I'll be here around 11 o'clock until 5 o'clock or so, and I'd love to see him, take some pictures, and 
sign some autographs for you. So, Cooter's Place. Lehman is played back to Stephen Williams. In 1982, when filming, he was 33 years old, and now he's living healthy life at the age of 74. You are the sheriff. You tell him that the both of y'all are gonna be out here at the Duke's farm for a couple of days, and that he is not to disturb you for anything. You got that? Hmm? Needs to be going on for me to get to the next place I'm going to. Okay, so I yeah. just accept whatever is happening in my life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I accept it that this is happening. Uncle Jesse is played back to Denver Pyle. In 1979 when filming, he was 59 years old, and sadly on December 25th, 1997, he passed away at the age of 77 in Burbank, California, USA. I don't know what you're talking about. Shoot! Roscoe, I want this car put back exactly like it was. Boss Hawk is played back to Sorrel Book. In 1979, when filming, he was 49 years old, and sadly, on February 11, 1994, he passed away at the age of 64 in Sherman Oaks, California, USA. The Royals. The hot damn Royals. The what? He means the royalties. That's right. Every girl on the moonshine, they pump into you. The Balladeer is played back to Waylon Jennings. In 1979, when filming, he was 42 years old, and sadly, on February 13, 2002, he passed away at the age of 64 in Chandler, Arizona, USA. Yeah. Uh, when I told him, I said, look, son, there's something I did a long time ago that was wrong. And I said, uh, and I'm going to try to... What's your favorite character from the Dukes of Hazard? and what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell to wait for my next videos. Thank you.